snapping pads got salt stains all over it. There's a bunch of noise in the neighborhood. It's not the best timing to do this, but I feel like I want to do it. I think I can work on the tip a little bit, make a long kind of pointed hand axe. I'll work on the base, get this better for holding. Maybe I'll try and fix up this messy area a little bit. Some flakes from this way. It'll be a fairly narrow, you know, body of the hand axe, but you know, it'll have a long use life. You can use it a bunch and reshape it, reshape it until it's smaller and then you know, keep turning it into something else. So it'll be a usable tool for sure. But I don't know how how much it's gonna look like a typical hand axe. We'll see. Also broke my good camera holder so I'm just using another one right now that's not very good for out here it was a nice blade bit more padding on the leg for this one.
takes. It's looking real bad. Real bad down there. Fixed up that problem mostly. Let it thin down the the butt, the base of this hand axe a little more than I wanted originally. And it had to be done at this point. better. Not exactly comfortable to hold yet. Got to get rid of some of this.
feels better. Even that way, I can use this to hold like that, so it works both ways. I think I'll just leave, leave the vase as is. Do a bunch of upgrading to dull it all down, and then I can finish the rest of the body and the tip. good. I think I'll do the tip first and then just do a little bit of shaping along the edges. Maybe I should use a smaller hammer stone but I don't really have a lot of good options probably use this one, it's a bit softer, it's not that much smaller, lighter. I think I'm, I'm used to using this one at this point, so stick with it. You see the tip needs a lot of work around here. piece so I have to be careful about end shock. like to clean that up if I can. Just use that one at this point. Good. Brutal. Okay.
this edge isn't great, but I'm not going to be able to do that much. It's not perfect, definitely, but I like it. It's a nice functional hand axe. You can do a lot of, you know, heavy, heavy butchering with this tool. You can use the tip for a lot of different things and sharpen it down as you use it. As you use it, it'll, it'll turn more from this long pointed hand axe to a shorter ovate hand axe. And that's a fairly natural progression for some of these things. Pretty authentic looking ugly hand axe. Long pointed hand axe. Something you might see in the Lower Paleolithic Acheulean industry.